Okay, this has been my most commented thing for a while now. So I'm gonna do the full breakdown of the Kendall Jenner situation. This is going to be the one where I give every specific detail, screenshot, everything, okay? If you don't have a sense of humor, head on out. It all started when Kendall dyed her hair red. I made a complete joke that she obviously got her inspiration from me. It's a similar color red to my hair. And I made a TikTok saying she, she must have seen me at the Suns game. As I was picked to play a game, I went on the Jumbotron. And Kendall watches all the Suns games because her boyfriend, Devin Booker, plays for the Suns. And she's also confirmed many times that she watches every game, no matter what. Now, that video was completely satire. However, shortly after that, I had posted this outfit, and then Kendall posted this. And so I was like, oh my gosh, it's so similar. Like, I have to run with the joke. It's just funny, you know? So I made another TikTok being like, oh my gosh, I didn't even say anything. I just put this picture side by side. It became a fun little inside joke on my page. People would tag me in videos of her and be like, wait, I thought that was you because we had similar hair and outfits. Kendall posted this photo of her um, around the 4th of July and I had posted this photo a while ago. Similar pose, you know, the hat. I put the photo side by side on my Instagram story. It had been a while since like a similar had happened and I just thought it was funny. And then something weird happened. An hour later, this photo was gone. It still, she still had all the other photos in the photo dump except she had just deleted this photo. And I was like, Okay, is that just the weirdest coincidence? Like, why did she take that specific photo down after I made a video? And I had made a, a TikTok about it and it had gone kind of viral. The week prior to this, I had posted this on my story. Laying on a beach towel with a bikini on, reading this specific book, The Surrender Experiment. Then this photo gets posted on Kendall's story. Her on a beach towel, reading the book, The Surrender Experiment. Now, there were other funny little photo similarities, outfit similarities, me on a boat, her like not even a week later on a boat with white baseball cap looking down. Me wearing silk pants on the beach. Next day, her wearing silk pants on the beach. Me in this pose wearing a cowboy hat in front of the water. Her same pose, cowboy hat in front of the water. I got cherries on my nails and I posted on Instagram. I was like, well, she didn't, she didn't copy the cherry nails. And then very shortly after I say that, she puts this little cherry emoji as her caption. Now, in the midst of all of this, Haley Bieber comments a heart on my video. And I said, sorry, Kendall, Haley's my bestie now, obviously as a joke. Shortly after she comments that heart on my page, the queen herself, Miss Haley Bieber, one of Kendall's closest friends, follows me on TikTok. So I was like, okay, has she seen the videos? Is she in on the joke? I, I don't know. Now let me make this very clear. I'm not coming for Kendall. It's me and Kendall against the world. We're obviously very similar and we need to be best friends. This is all this is telling me.